Hi, I'm Patrick Fijis. I'm Erin Smith. Welcome to Fijis Barbecue. Best food court barbecue in Texas. I got the sliced brisket and it was pretty much falling apart. It I get it just slaughtered in barbecue sauce and super, super good. I go from the baked potato, uh, the brisket sandwich, all the two meat plates. I could have eaten this with my hands if I wanted to. We say we're the best food court barbecue in Texas because I mean, we're probably the only food court barbecue in Texas, but uh, if there's any out there, we don't know about it, but we'll, we'll claim that title. So we joke around, it's like, if you can't pronounce it, it's gotta be good. Yeah, like the harder it is to pronounce, the better the barbecue. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm not an expert, <laughs> but I say Vegas, I guess, and that, that could be wrong. Fe Fiji's. You want me to go ask somebody? I don't want to screw that up. <laughs> We actually have a shirt where we pronounce, we have the phonetic pronunciations of the um, name. Figs. Fegs. Fegs. I pronounce it good barbecue. We were originally looking for something above ground. We call this our subterranean restaurant and this opportunity kind of fell into our lap and we felt like it was a really good place to start. 13,000 people is a pretty great captive audience. We've got a lot of regulars, so people come multiple times a week. Give me some more sour cream. Kind of hooked me up on that one. I know that Texans really like barbecue, but I don't think most people eat barbecue three times a week. I just started like at an office building nearby and um, and my coworkers have been taking me and it's literally amazing. We feel pretty lucky that we're in a place where we can get that. Look like you got to refill that. <laughs> I feel like because we're in a food court, people are usually underestimating it. They're like, okay, food court barbecue, I don't know about this. I'm just here just visiting and I wasn't expecting something like this to be in a food court area. You'd expect barbecue like this to be in one of those main big places. It's called American barbecue. It's we borrow from the Carolinas, we borrow from Kansas City style, we borrow from all over international flavors in it. Uh, Houston is a huge international population. You see that in the food that we do. We take a lot of flavors from around the world and incorporate them into the spices that we use in our sides. Um, I think a lot of our sides menu is very light and you know everything's from scratch, everything's really vegetable driven. I think the fact that our sides have a lot of variety and freshness to them really kind of helps broaden our menu. The items on our menu are brisket, turkey breast, pulled pork, whole hog, ribs, Boudin, sausage, pork belly. Our sides options, we have the loaded potato salad, sweet potato and banana mashers, sweet and spicy sprouts, macaroni salad, elote, charo beans, kale salad, braised collard greens, and the Moroccan spiced carrots. And yogurt and cilantro slaw. It's a healthier option. It's got this really, really great, like kind of intense Indian flavor. Outside of the meats, this is our most popular side. Um, we recently had to take it off the menu, and then today is the first day that we're bringing it back. If I'm a first time customer, I am getting a two meat plate. You gotta get brisket, because it's Texas. I would add some whole hog to that plate. And then for my two sides, I would get our Brussels sprouts and the sweet potato and banana mashers. Probably the best combination of food you're gonna get in Texas. And if I had one thing that I had to eat, it would be the peanut butter and jelly chocolate cake. Ooh, good idea. <laughs> We're able to learn a lot of lessons here, kind of manage things on a smaller scale and grow from there. I don't know that there's another food court where you can get barbecue like ours. <laughs>